Greetings. This is Darth Lane and welcome back to Avernum. In the last episode, we explored the former fortress of Gargrahoth and found the Royal Seal. So we should have everything we need, apart from how to deal with the trap, to escape Avernum. But we're not going to do that yet. Buy some supplies because I am getting bored. 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 See, iron longsword. Dump those. We'll keep your steel shield. Yeah, we'll keep those. We've got here you. So those. Show you iron longsword. We've got fish. Yeah. So what we want to do is buy some crossbow bolts. So iron bolts. There we go. Still take the money, but we can say we can't have more than a hundred of them. Cheeky bugger. Okay. Now that's out of the way. Move on. Hello, there's something down here. Just seen it. Okay, let's see what's in here then. This hidden tunnel is interrupted in a dark, swiftly flowing river extending to the north and south, far beyond the range of your light. The tunnel continues to the east. Fortunately, someone has erected a small crude bridge over the river. A wide gallery ends in a cramped tunnel heading into the chasm wall. There are dried blood stains on the ground nearby. Walk inside. The tunnel ends in a cave which was once a home for about eight soldiers. The bodies of the soldiers are arranged neatly across the floor. They have been dead for some time and all died violently. Two things immediately grab your interest. First, the Empires wear the uniforms of the surface army, the Empire. Second, there is a message painted on the wall in blood. Such is the fate of all above us who threw us down, the Scimitar. <coughs> ah, the Scimitar, the group you have joined is clearly active in the war against the Empire. <coughs> Cursory search reveals that the killers did, a little, did little looting. You find a scattering of coins, both from the surface world of Venom and a small flask. So we get an elixir. Uh, healing, haste, heap. Because it was unidentified when it went in, it didn't stack. Okay, fair enough. But that was a nice little. Thing, wasn't it? Someone has cro craft a sword crude a crude sword design into the wall here. Interesting. So I guess that's your clue that it's there. Let's 
kill some giant lizards. Yay! That's the Tower of Patrick. Don't need to go there. However, what I do want to do is check out the Gremlin Cave. I don't think we checked this out to see if there was any anything we can get in That looks pretty done. So, yeah, we've done that one. Which reminds me, I keep trying to get rid of your cursed items. Press chainmail. Yay! Cursed lever. Yay! Saffron. Done in here, so we'll go straight across the spire, Fort Spire. You want me to go a long way around? Thank you. Ray's famous adventure. Famouses we are. We are famouses is is. Okay. Don't know where everything is now. Now this is Spire. That is a demon plus gargarach. Isn't it? So let's go Spire. Check out Spire where we're here. And then we'll go check out Yep, there was uh, something there was that we couldn't get into. Not a problem now. Talk to Entwistle. You caress a man with stained clothes lows behind the counter. He gives you a nasty look. What are you selling? I supply goods of all sorts. You look to be voles, but your money is as good as any. So if you want to buy something, if you, so you can buy something if you want, but if you plan on thievery, watch it. Okay. What's there to steal round here? Well, there was a circlet, but someone stole it. 
and we're very glad too. He chuckles. You deal in odd goods. Can you identify my items? Can only twenty five got also curious about let me take a look at your goods. What are you selling? Unshackling crystal. Piercing crystal, ring of skill, grey mould and a recall another recall crystal. Unshackling crystal which you can use to stop your Yeah, okay. Bye. Stupid, wasn't it? Okay, let's go over here and then we will look at other things. No, that's the secret tunnel that don't go anywhere. place worth going is Gargaroth, which is down there. Okay. Said six bunches. I've only got one. Yes. So this is Gargaroth. There's a massive structure completely blocking the passage to the east. The walls are formed of massive blocks of stone. Whoever built this place was determined that nobody got get past without considerable trouble. The wall facing you has no visible means of entry. As you watch the fort, a pair of gates slowly appear in the wall, allowing you entry. As you watch, the, a word appears above the gates, carved into the stone. The word is Skaragoth. Okay, there were three large runes on this stone sign. You recognise them. Warning, imprisonment and death. Okay. Shrine stuff for this book. This book lists those who died to defeat Grahoth. It is a long list of names and the dates of their deaths. You don't recognise any of the names. They all died around 40 years ago, roughly the time of founding of Vernum. The book ends with the inscription, and many more will be added to this grim list should Grahoth ever be freed. What about this other one? Okay, same. 
again. Skeletal remains of a human stands in front of a stone chair. It wears a tarnished iron crown. Heat radiates fr from its foul form and he watches you intently from empty eye sockets. Who are you? Why are you here? I am a wizard. I died long past in a war against our prisoner. Tell me about the prisoner. Once, long ago, there was a war against an army of demons and foul spirits. With others, I led our troops and I fell, a gout of Hakai flame shattering my chest. I am here now, forever, trying to keep the unknowing from freeing the demon lord Grahoth. With others, who helped you? Those still among the living. Selberg and Erica Redmark and Patrick and Linda are the greatest of us. They fight on. I stay here watching our prisoner. How is the demon lord imprisoned? Beyond this place lies the tower where the mighty demon lord Grahoff lies imprisoned. It is unlikely you could free him, but if you did, your mind cannot encompass the consequences. What sort of consequences? We could not kill him. I am sure you can't either. If he wishes to fill a Vernon with his foul he wishes to fill the Vernon with his foul brood, and the humanity of the caves would serve as his cattle. Do not let this happen. Leave now before you do unimaginable harm. I beg you in the name of a Vernon. Go now. Something else I'd like to fight. Grahoff is attacking a Vernon from within his prison. He must be destroyed. No. No, I tell you. No matter how much harm he does inside his prison, he will do far, far more outside it. In his prison he must stay. Okay. But can't I kill him in his prison? Isn't that the old idea? vengeful shade but he doesn't look hostile that's the thing I'll take the two gold coins thank you Why is the floor shocking me? Fight you all now. Okay.
Hello, Mr. Wizard. Excuse me. Sorry about that. Uh, where were we? Oh, yes. Basically fighting this entire fortress full of spirits. Come get some. Shall exorcise the demons. It's a bit depressing that you've basically got to kill everyone just to open this thing. Oh well. There's a huge brass phone on this platform. To either side of it are two braziers, burning scented wood. It's strange that the braziers are lit, considering you're the first living people to be here for some time. There is a large kneeling pad promptly placed next to the phone. Let's kneel. The image of King Michael of Avernum appears sitting on the throne. He looks a good deal younger than the aging man you met in the castle. The image begins to speak. I don't know who you are. I don't know what allegiances you hold. I only know this. You should not be here. A horrible force lies beyond this place. Should it be freed, all of our young nation will suffer. But we realise that, for some reason, one day it may be necessary for someone to pass. Be sure that it is necessary, and be sure to perform the ritual to deactivate the guards. The image disappears and the throne sits empty. Ritual? Nobody about the castle told you about any ritual. Maybe they forgot about it. Odd. Very odd. So that is open. Da 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 The Prison of Grahoff. Let's grab what we can from around the outside, I guess. So you're a 
over here. Yeah. Divine fire. Found ya. <laughs> Little bastard. Damn annoying. Damn annoying. I saw Stare on the Maybe it was your, maybe it was your imagination, but you could swear that you saw one of the cave walls to the south shimmer slightly when you got close. Gotcha. You can see a circle of painted runes on the floor in the entrance to this chamber. When you get close to the entrance, they glow red. The air starts to feel warm. Could be a trap. Let's leave. I think there's going to be <laughs> there by the fire. Watch. 
Gotcha. Do not enter. Okay. Did you just run away? There's a small monument in here, it is carving a free mage shooting huge bolts of fire into a bottle. The inscription is worn away. When you enter the room, the room suddenly stop glowing. The air turns cool again. Nothing else happens. Okay. Shade in here.
shades in the corner and the golems. <laughs> Wand of Slurring, one device.
ist die letzte.
hell did I end up over there? What? You've reformed my party over there, okay. But you've got nothing because you dropped it all. Okay. I just wanted to know. We're gonna be doing that one a bit more clever a bit more cleverly there, aren't we? Can't rest in this part of the part. All right, we'll wait then. That I do. You've moved, where is you? Do this the old fashioned way.
That's why there's so many. There's one in each corner. Cheeky little buggers. Gotcha, that was a tough little room, wasn't it? Hmm. And I think after all that, we are going to save it here. I'm going to save what's in the next room for next episode. So this has been Darvain doing a Let's Play of Vernum. If you like what you've seen here, be sure to like, subscribe, share and comment. Please consider sponsoring me on Patreon. And until next time, goodbye.